Okay, welcome to the Barbican edition. The Barbican, if you don't know, most people don't know, uh, was actually the brainchild of Sebastian Coe. Uh, it was an attempt to encourage more women into sport, hence the name Barbie Can, Barbie Can. And in the background there, there's some hopefuls. Dad's seen enough. See that dad. That's actually a statue. Uh, it was the start of a statue only of Sally Gunnell's thigh. Uh, and to inspire, there's some more hopefuls. You see there inside Ben Johnson's house. That's where you go to get your drugs. Get them directly from Seb Co himself. This young man is riding the winds of, I don't know, dreams. Uh, he doesn't know that it's females only. He will come back down to earth with a bump, hopefully. Oh, look, Dad's back. Uh, there's one of the uh, diving boards. Um, could have been used for the Olympic Games in 1982, but never got there. More diving boards. Uh, not sure what that is in the background. There's the swimming pool. Uh, very green. Looks like someone spilt some milk there in the corner. Uh, this is a long clip. I'm not sure what we're waiting for. Maybe something's going to pop up. No. Uh, this is where the uh, observators were. Oh, more diving boards. Um, There's a lot of diving boards. Uh, that's uh, a B-52 stealth bomber. Uh, Theresa May had baked into the concrete just in case we needed it, which probably we will. Uh, football references there for you. Jermaine Defoe, Lee Trundle's dad. Uh, was never supposed to be used for sky cycling or skateboarding. There's Linford Christie Way. Uh, obviously, Linford Christie's way is to inject. Uh, this is where it started going wrong for them. Uh, developers got pissed off. They had all the land, so they started building massive phallic shapes in the background to intimidate uh, these female athletes, and uh, apparently it worked, because these days it is used as a prison for white-collar crime. Uh, there you go, it's looking quite bleak there. Uh, I don't know what we're waiting for. There's one of the cells. There's someone on day release up there, by the look of it. Um, gardening, they do a lot of gardening, clearly. Uh, helps with the, uh, the soul, probably. Uh, red room down there, I don't know what they use that for. Presumably it's for porn. Uh, looks like a porn room. Uh, yes, that's, a, that's actually a childcare centre, uh, which is just about the darkest thing I've ever seen in my life. That's the, the gardens where all the inmates work out. Quite regularly see 300 uh, inmates there, some dogs, plastic dogs, uh, crimes against carcinogens. Oh yes, this is um, when the bell rings and you have to get back in your cell, you've got three seconds to get back in there. So quite often, life stops dead uh, in the Barbican Centre, as you can see here. Uh, somebody obviously missed their curfew. Um, not sure what he's trying to prove there. Uh, he's still there. Maybe that guy wasn't a hopeful. Maybe he's an inmate. Uh, so, yes, that's what I was hoping for. Emergency telephone. Let's uh, dob on him and hopefully get him, uh, I don't know, put in solitary for the next 12 years. That's actually where Harry Potter was filmed. Uh, not a lot of people know that uh, because it's not true.